there's some really dark spots in our history, mm -hmm. you know, and uh, uh, we did some bad things. Now, it, maybe that's the price of running an empire. I mean, I don't know. Maybe. maybe. I mean, there's an argument that can be made for that. Absolutely. Yeah. So, um, yeah, and all the time they try to kill, but also like some of their incompetence. Like what? What did they? They tried to kill Castro. They what? What did they try to put poison in his boots? It was like it was something like the, that. It was the, some of the dumbest stuff I've heard. I'm like, why would they even do that? Like, I'm thinking in my mind, like, come on, man. Of course, now I know why. Like, well, I, I want to say this. I think the Castro thing proved they're not infallible either. You know, I I kind of we kind of get this like, oh, there's the Charlie boys and stuff like that. But then when you read like with how they tried to, you know, do Castro and they could never do it, you know, it's like maybe like in some in some instances, they're not as, you know, invincible as as, as portrayed. Mm -hmm. Well, it seems the popular theory that is making the rounds now about JFK. And again, I don't necessarily buy into or disbelieve this theory. I think you can make an argument for or against it, but that was that it was actually the mob that carried out a hit on JFK and the CIA knew about it ahead of time, allegedly, but were powerless to stop it. 